Police in Bula on Wednesday arrested four suspected copper cable thieves after intercepting a pickup truck with South African number plates during routine patrols in the city. We hear more from Bulawayo Police Provincial Spokesperson Inspector Pet Nikonube. This day, we had uh, some routine patrols along our CBD roads to control traffic and to check for any other offenses. After deployment, a team was sent out leading to an interception with the vehicle behind me, a Ford with South African number plates, which was stopped but could not. It seemed to be having a, a load behind. The traffic police officers followed the motor vehicle, at the same time phoning, calling for backup from the station. The officer in charge operation, Inspector Spanda, then took another vehicle to as a backup and caught up with the vehicle next to National University of Science and Technology in Bulawayo, where upon seeing two police vehicles in pursuit, the driver sped and was involved in an accident where he hit a tree. The occupants jumped off, taking away some bags of which were containing some heavy material and dashed into the bush. The police officers, however, managed to give a chase and apprehended one, uh, Warren Machinga, who is aged 46 years and is coming from Lobengula Old. And they also called for our canine section to make some searches around, which led to uh, another road where the accused persons, who are not known in number, boarded another vehicle and made good their escape. During the time when Warren Machenga was being interviewed by the police, a Honda Fit, which is just on my left, approached the police officers and produced 260 United States dollars and 100 rands as bribe to the police for them to release the South African vehicle, which had some copper cables in it, as well as a lot of implements that are used to cut copper in Bulawayo and in areas around. The police officers made some recordings from the accused persons who were offering the bribe, leading to their being arrested, and they are also with us at the police station, helping us with investigations. We would want to appreciate our dedicated uh, police officers who managed to pursue these copper thief criminals until their arrest and were carrying some